The governor of River State, Nisam Wike, has insisted that there is a need to have a new government that cares about the unity of the country and the well-being of its citizens. Governor Wike bemoaned the inability of the all-progressive Congress, the APC-led federal government, over the last seven years to keep the economic and social conditions within Nigeria from deteriorating. The early years of independence were indeed glorious for our nation and our people. The founding fathers were clear in their vision and overly patriotic in their mission to build a truly federal, democratic, and prosperous nation guided by a truly federal constitution, the rule of law, and the timeless values of equity, justice, and social solidarity. Sadly, this great vision was short-lived, and the march toward the nation's advancement was aborted and replaced by a strange, problematic, and dysfunctional federal system of governance by the illegal military adventurers. Although we have been a constitutional democracy since 1999, deliberate constitutional distortions, institutional weaknesses, and widespread corruption continue to prevent us from enjoying a robust democratic practice, including free and fair elections, the rule of law, and social justice from taking root in our country. He noted the spiraling crime and physical violence that are almost out of control across the country, with schools, churches, and mosques no longer serving as safe places. After 62 years, Nigeria deserves more than what it has achieved, and Nigerians likewise deserve much more than what their leaders have delivered to them with the country's enormous natural and human resources. Over the last, the last seven years, the economic and social conditions of our country keep deteriorating under the all progressive Congress led government, which is totally lost in what further measures to take to free or ameliorate the predicaments that are visited on Nigerians. Life is sacrosanct, but the present federal government has failed in the most basic duty to the nation to protect the lives and property of its citizens. Under their watch, infrastructure across all sectors, including roads, education, and healthcare, has collapsed. And Nigeria's current economic, social, and security situation can rapidly be resolved with new leadership that is courageous, decisive, purposeful, and able to take the country in a new direction that will curb corruption, stop unsustainable debts, and drive economic growth to create jobs and prosperity for all citizens. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.